What's up guys, Jahoot here, and this is a bit of anything where I do a bit of everything. Whether it's something I'm passionate about, or something suggested from one of my supporters, or just something I find amusing at the moment. And at the moment, I'm having real trouble going to sleep. I try watching TV. Uh, let's see what new movies on Netflix that I'm not gonna watch. I'm going back to DVDs. I tried playing the game. Get off the court, bro. Get off the court, bro. You, who are you playing for? You, you're not even playing, bro. Like, what, what are you doing? Nobody else see this? Nobody else see this? Hmm, bro. <laughs> I swear to God, you're not touching this ball again. Bro, you a straight trash. You literally a trash. Like, why are you even playing, bro? You're not even really trying to play. You over here. Fucking getting nothing but turnovers. I'm sorry. Oh, you know what? I'm not sorry. You're sorry. You see this? Stop it. You straight three and 19 in just one quarter. What are you doing? Like, straight garbage. <laughs> now you a point guard, can't make nothing. Bro, do you see? Do you, yeah, anybody? You straight, you, I promise you, you're not touching this ball no more. I promise you. You, you. you do see this, right? All right. Alright, right. just let me know I ain't sure. Okay. That's cool. That's cool. But no, it's not. Yes, but no. 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 Um, I thought somebody that came in the corner pocket said something. Uh, 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 Nothing is working. At this point, I don't know what to do. Hmm, I got it. I think I'm gonna read a book. And what better way to do that than to read one of my favorite childhood books, Thomas the Tank Engine, the original railway series. So go ahead and get y'all nightcaps on. We finna take a look into Pandora's box. Within this box contains 26 of the original stories written by Reverend W. Audrey. These stories are pretty much based off real train events, and that's what makes Thomas Lore so much more real. Like, for example, Thomas falling down a mine, and Douglas backing into a train signal and breaking van. When he wrote these books, it was at the time when his son was sick of sickles. So he decided to start writing children's books for him. What if I told you that Thomas was never actually the main focus? He's pretty much the face of the group, the marketing. He didn't show up until the second book, which didn't come out until 1946, a year later after the first, 1945. But I think I know exactly what story I'm gonna read to you guys today. Pop goes the diesel. City of Truro visit made Duck very proud of being Great Western. He talked endless about it, but he worked hard too and made everything go like clockwork. The trucks behaved well, the coaches were ready on time, and the passengers even stopped grumbling. But the engines didn't like having a bustle about. There are two ways of doing this, Duck told them. The Great Western way or the wrong way. I'm Great Western and don't we know it, they groaned. They were glad when a visitor came. The visitor purred smoothly towards them. The fat controller climbed down. Here's Diesel, he said. I have agreed to give him a trial. He needs to learn. Please teach him, duck. Good morning, purred Diesel in an oily voice. Pleased to meet you, duck. Is that Jane? 
Williams and Henry and Gordon too. I'm delighted to meet such famous engines. The silly engines were flattered. He has very good manners, they murmured. We're pleased to have him in the yard. Duck had his doubts. Come on, he said shortly. You're worthy, fat. Sir Topham hat to you, ordered Duck. Diesel looked hurt. You're worthy, Sir Topham hat thinks I need to learn. He is mistaken. We Diesels don't need to learn. We know everything. We come to a yard and improve it. We are revolutionary. Ah, oh, said Duck. If you're rather fond of me, perhaps you wouldn't mind collecting my trucks while I fetch Gordon's coaches. Diesel, delighted to show off, purred away. With much banging and clashing, he collected a roll of trucks. Duck left Gordon's coaches in the station and came back. Diesel was now trying to take some trucks from a siding nearby. They were old and empty. Clearly, they had not been touched for a long time. The brakes would not come off properly. Pull, push, backwards, forward. <laughs> the trucks groaned. We can't. We won't. Duck watched the operation with interest. Diesel lost patience. <laughs> and gave a great heave. The trucks jerked forward. <laughs> they screamed. We can't. We won't. Some of their brakes broke, and the gears hanging down bumped on the rails and sleepers. We can't! We won't! Ah! Their trailing brakes caught in the points and locked themselves solid. <laughs> He's roared. A rusty couple broke and he shot forward suddenly by himself. <laughs> Chuckled Duck. Diesel recovered and tried to push the trucks back, but they wouldn't move and he had to give up. Duck ran round to where the trucks all stood in line. Thank you for arranging these, Diesel, he said. I must go now. Don't you want this lot? No, thank you. Diesel gulped. And I taken all this trouble? He almost shrieked. Why didn't you tell me? Well, you never asked me. Besides, said Duck innocently, you were having such fun being rather whatever you said. Goodbye. Diesel had to help the workmen clear the mess. He hated it. All the trucks and coaches were laughing. Presently, he heard them sing. Their song grew louder and louder, and soon it echoed through the yard. Trucks are waiting, waiting in the yard, yard. Time to put on the easel. Show the world what, what I can do. do. Get the most of the easel. In every creek about, like a big black weasel. When he poured around, trucks are trucks out. Pop goes the easel. He growled. Oh, okay, so y'all making songs now. Y'all y'all can rap. Okay, well, check this out. D-I-E. S-E-L, I'm devious diesel, I approve the rails. Them stinky steamies, they are bound to fail. Yeah, boo! Boo! Stop it! Shut boo! up! You suck! Yeah. It's one of my favorite stories. And honestly, one of my favorite episodes. But we can talk about that another day. Anyway. I'm Joe. If you like what you see, like and subscribe, comment below, let me know. If you like to see more of this, just comment, hit that like button.